So for what I want to discuss for it was the first match was Jeremiah Crane versus Mil Mortez. I knew that Mil would win and he did, but not before he and Jeremiah tore the crap out of each other. They really put on a show. They really wowed uh, my friend and I. They really uh, put on a clinic. It was just amazing. They he took their best shots, but in the end, Mil Mortez uh, Jeremiah in advance to uh yeah and events in the Quito Cup. Uh wherever Jeremiah was at his entrance, uh Mimorsas uh I, I attacked him from behind and got an early jump on him and in the end he beat Jeremiah. The match before that was uh for the Radio to Seven Ancient Aztec Medallions. It was a uh, uh the Rabbit Tribe, uh it was a uh, in um Mas Horte who means bad luck in Spanish and Sator versus the World Underground's Taya um PJ Black and Ricky Mandel, aka Hedgehog Mundo's number one fan in his wannabe. He wants to be him. Um I uh I really uh believe that the World Underground would win, but they did not. Uh the rubber tribe won and that really surprised me uh on Wednesday. Uh so I guess um at least so right now, uh Taya's PJs and Ricky's chances of, of having a match at the Ultimate Race in in a kicks are over, at least for right now. And then the main event was uh Pentagon Dark versus Hano uh in a cup match. I knew that Pen would win, would win, and he did. And uh, during the match, uh, B and Brenda uh, tried to help out Tejano by um, famous B uh, uh, threw Tejano a horseshoe, but actually did at the Pentagon and Pentagon. You you did um, obviously what that the referee is saying hit uh, Tejano with it. And he beat, you know, and then after the match, uh, whenever a uh, Pentagon tried to break, uh, break his arm, uh, Pentagon's B tried to, uh, I stopped him from doing so, but he broke his B's arm instead. Um, and then whatever Brenda went to the aid of Famous B, uh, he broke her arm too. And so, as so I guess if uh, people want to, Gender quality in wrestling. There you go. And for NXT segment was Sanity, uh, a painful match to the AOP. Whenever the office of pain made their way to the ring, uh, Eric Young went the turn and got an early jump on the office of pain. Bobby Roode and Drew McIntyre uh, face to face, where um, um, 
before Drew challenges Bobby Roode for the uh, anti championship at TakeOver. And, and, and then somewhere at the end of that, uh, uh, Raw Drew Strong uh, tried to administer himself into that, but when we go said uh, that he has to weigh his uh, opportunity and then opportunity arose for um, Roderick where next week uh, Drew would face uh, Roderick and if Roderick wins then Bobby would face uh, Roderick for, uh, for the championship um, after after uh, um, uh, takeover but if Drew is the, is the champion after takeover which honestly won't be surprised then uh, Roderick would uh, challenge uh, Drew for the championship and it was Danny Burper's Birch versus Oni Lorcan. I thought that uh, Birch would win just because um, Oni beat Birch uh, for some of phase and so it would be fair for Danny to win. And then it was a job that said Ahmed versus uh, Noe Jose. I thought that Jose would win, but no, it was the opposite. Uh, almost won. And then associate of um, Almas, who, who was actually the real uh, fiance of Austin Aries, the uh, turned dad. Because uh, that night, whenever Johnny Gargano said that he he doesn't have an opponent for a takeover, uh, his associate Athea said that. Well, guess what? He does now. So it would it will be um, Andrade Yamas versus versus uh, this is a Johnny wrestling himself at takeover, and that would be a Johnny's first first um, takeover uh, event. Uh, uh, since he, since uh, the DIY um, death section.